Hundreds of books are challenged or removed from schools and libraries, and believe it or not, there are several childhood favorites once on that list, some by authors now considered iconic. So on the daily list, I've got three children's books you might not know were once banned. <gasps> One of my young, uh, younger sister's favorites back in the day, Harriet the Spy Okay. by Louise Fitz. She was banned. She's a spy. Well, she's a spy. I can't read about that. <laughs> uh, Harriet the Spy was challenged in 1983 at a school board meeting in Xenia, Ohio, where some argued the book encouraged children to disrespect their parents by lying, talking back, cursing, and yes, Cody, spying on others. Oh. Yeah. Really don't need to encourage kids to do that. Yeah. Already. The character of Harriet was also believed to be a bad influence on children because of her ah. abrasiveness and improper behavior. Oh, my, oh God. my goodness. Look at, her wearing, look at her there wearing pants. <laughs> How dare she? Upstart. Uh, number two. Uh, this one is kind of scary. Where the wild things <gasps> are. What? By Maurice Sendak. Of course, what? this book faced many opponents immediately after it came out back in 1963. The country couldn't handle it. Readers believed it was psychologically damaging and traumatizing to children due to Max's inability to control his emotions and his punishment of being sent to bed without dinner. <laughs> Psychologists called it too dark. <laughs> and the book was banned largely in the South, uh -huh. Cody. Yeah, oh. Yeah. <laughs> It's also been challenged several times for its images of witchcraft and supernatural elements. But look at the beast is like asleep right there. I know, but I'm, I'm well, it's it, it rumpus. I love this. Crazy. I know. It's so scary. Watch my pearls. And this one, <laughs> uh, another childhood favorite in our house, James and the Giant <gasps> Peach. What? Oh, my old doll. The book has been banned and challenged several times since its publication, uh, namely for being too scary for its targeted age group. It's also believed to promote poor behavior, such as disobedience, oh, and as some references note, communism. Uh -huh. <laughs> That's a bad I don't know, I just see a caterpillar and a ladybug and a grasshopper and a kid standing on a worm. What's the big deal? What's the big What's deal? What's the big deal? Uh, for more info, more books that were once banned, including almost everything Dr. Seuss ever wrote, go to gooddaysacramento.com. Click show info there at the top of the page and then today's date. All right. Well, we'd like to lighten